I'm making repair kits now. I've got a basic bandage. I've got several basic bandages. I'm putting half of them in uh in there. Bellows. Um Yeah, it looks like I'm probably going to end up dying of this disease if I don't get rid of it. Good news, though, I do have a uh, another point to spend. <laughs> Here, uh, I've got something for you. <laughs> Level 50. Yeah, go ahead and give me uh, the one that you have. The you scrapped it. <laughs> oh, that's fine. I was going to scrap it, but... There's a stone I got for it. <laughs> I think the next one I might do is put a point in mother load. Does that give you more resources when you yeah. mine? Yep, gives you more ore, stone, terrain blocks, and trees. Yeah, once we can get some forged iron going, um, I can actually make a... Uh... It is the furnace going? Yes, there should be stuff in the furnace already. Just get to make the ingots out of there. Okay. Oh yeah, we need to put clay in there. Oh, you're taking that apart, nice. 
I didn't get any ingots for it though. They totally raised the price for making a uh, the anvil for the. Yeah. It's really expensive now. I need some wood. Yeah, I'm grabbing some clay while digging the trench, so. Why does this tree look blue? My eyes playing tricks or something? What tree? These trees look blue. Out, out of front. North side. Uh. There's a slight blue haze, but other than that. Yeah, there's just a slight blue haze. Other than that, it looks fine. The trees are feeling blue. I'm at 2% on my disease. You think you could go out and try to find a uh, honey stump? Stumps, yeah. I mean, we are in the right biome for it, so. Yep. And whenever we want to get a hunt, we want honey, we won't get it. Right? And then when we don't need it, we find it, and then use it within like, you know, one in-game day of finding it. <laughs> Here's a stump. Waking up zombies trying to smack a stump. No honey. See, that's why I miss the bees. The bees used to give you honey. Mm-hmm. All right, I've got clay in there as well as the, uh, as well as iron, so. What should I do with this advanced bellows? I mean, um, the second one. I think one. you can stack. I'm not sure. I've got zombies on my butt. Well, one, one of them is in the forge. The other one... I'm just putting it in our extra chest. I'm going to grab a whole bunch of stuff and see if I can smelt them. Ooh, there's a level six lead car battery. That's nice. Yeah, I picked that up. We've got forged steel. We got ten of it anyway. Almost died. 
Yeah, that's like half of what I need for anything is the forge is 10 forged steel. Uh, these extra cooking pots and cooking grill. Unless you want to make a second, uh, a second, uh, well, I'm gonna Fire, hold. But, I'm gonna hold yeah. on to one cooking grill and one cooking pot. Uh, yeah, that's so what I usually do. That way we can. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I got the trap doors open, by the way. Okay. Don't forget there's this uh, car in the garage you can take apart with the... Uh... Mm -hmm. I was getting stone so I can make some arrows. And wood. You can take it by anything with the wrench. Yeah. Anything that's like a mechanical thing. Yeah, or even like file cabinets. Oh, we didn't yeah. go into the. We haven't gone inside the this little room where the safe. The what? In this locked room where the safe is. Where? Down here in the little side room. Under the stairs. Oh, I didn't know that was there. You hit me. Sorry. And this I'm not bleeding out. It's not pointy. Yeah, you'll recover it. There's zombies outside. You want to take care of the zombies? I'll uh my 19 health. Yeah, I can pick it. Okay, I'll go. For, I'll, I'll go get the zombies. Sounds like there's at least two out there. Yeah, they're trying to break through the wall over here. Man, it had like 0. 0.3 left and it broke. I think I'm going to wait until they bust through this and then start hitting them. Just to... Finally. Ooh, I got a pokey. And more more seven six two for you. Chain reaction there. Well, there's a one thing to replace with new walls. Okay, well, um, good thing I've got uh, 300 cobblestone blocks. Morning.
Don't you hate it when you put a uh, flagstone block in the wrong place? Yeah. At least when you're busting it down now, you get one rock and one uh, clay every now and then from it. What's hitting me? Oh, you. Hitting the thing. Yeah, you hit me. And let me go ahead and replace the open parts over here. Oh, the machine don't work. The what? Like the drink machine doesn't give any have any food. Oh. It's not, well, it's not lit up, so. No, I picked it apart. Ooh, got something forged. I can't tell what it is. I think it's steel. Steel and iron look too similar. Yeah. What are you taking apart right now? That chilled drinks machine that's not oh, working. Okay. Yep, it's still. I thought it looked a little shinier. The ones that are powered will electrocute you when you hit it. Did you put this door here? Oh. Yep. No, the door just randomly appeared. Yes, I put the door there. Zombies did it. Right? That's why they're all wearing engineering hats. Because they're smart. All right, my disease is at 4.9. Uh-oh. Feels like deja vu all over again from from last, last time, game. yeah. I think every time so far that I've gotten the disease, I ended up dying and just resetting it, you know. But this well, you time You died from something else. Just... Yeah, this time if I die um, I'm going to actually lose experience points, but it's not that bad. I did it on, uh, uh, on my single player once and it wasn't that bad. I just had to gain the experience points back. Kill more zombies. Yeah. Cause that's how it is now. It's that, uh, you lose the experience points temporarily until you would have gained them back. It's it's weird. So if you sit there and wait, the XP comes back? Um, I don't know. I just know that you have I to... I don't think... I, I think you just have to, uh... Earn it back. Earn it back, yeah.
Yeah, iron and steel look very similar, but if you look at the icon, iron has... Uh, the steel looks a little more shinier. Well, iron has F-E on it, and steel has S-S. But apparently you need, need a, you need a crucible yeah. to make st forged steel, so... Mm -hmm. And you have to be, like, almost expert level to to make the crucible or get lucky and find the recipe book or the blueprint. Yeah. Yeah, found another stump. Cross your fingers. Yeah, Yay! I'm about to come out and start looking. I'm at 5.7 right now. Yeah, so this won't help. You need to find another one. Right. I'll give you this one right now, though. Unless I see another stump on the way back. Yeah, right now I'm making up a forged iron so I can make a better iron sledgehammer. Cool. And you can, also make, uh, better you can also make the repair kits. Yeah, I don't know if a hunting knife uses steel or iron, but... I don't think it uses steel it uses iron okay i yeah. remember the the wrench used steel but not anymore i don't know what the hammer beside it means i guess okay yeah hammer means you just make it in your inventory okay so i need four well, iron like a... wood leather and duct tape but uh, if it's a hammer and an anvil, then it's the forge. But if I'm not mistaken... Uh, what lets you craft better... I got two points in Lucky Looter and I'm still finding shit. Like, nothing. There we go. Uh, the dexterity lets you make level two knives. Okay. So I'm going through the strength line, so I'll be making sledgehammers. Sledgehammer. I may just put another point into fit next time so I can make even better sledgehammers, but... I need to put mine in cardio so I can gain more stamina. Yeah, because I need two points. One to get my strength up and one to increase my skull crusher by one point. Yeah, because I need you know, honey. strength level five for smasher, seven for bone breaker, and ten for skull crusher. Uh, where's this Honey's honey? In the food box. All right, I'm coming. All right, now if we can just find another jar of honey, I'll be good. Before you hit 5% again. Yeah, right now I'm at 6.2. So after that, you'll probably be uh, just under two. Because it takes time to work. Yeah. Too bad you can't just like take a chainsaw, cut a tree down, and get a stump, and then cut the stump and get honey. I thought we had more than just one duct tape. No, I've been using them to make repair kits. Oh, because I'm gonna need uh four we duct tape to make the iron sledgehammer I want to make. Well, there's lots of uh, bones to make glue. 
Uh, let's see, you only need one glue, so I'll need three glue and a bunch of cloth. Do we have glue? We have three glue, yay! Oh, and I've got a bunch of cloth already. Man, he was a pain in the butt. Yeah, I leveled. I killed the biker. Man, he took forever to kill. On my single player game, I'm so spoiled. <laughs> well, because I'm like, I'm past week six and I'm in just tearing stuff up. Yeah. I got it. You know, the 4x4, four four, which is kind of fun. It holds tons. It holds like an entire like uh, thing. Oh, they get, I got honey. Nice. I'm about down to 5%. But I don't know what uh, my actual percentage will be. Well, it should show the percentage for both of them, for the honey and the, the infection. So whichever is higher. Um, it just says treated mild infection 4.9% now. Okay. I, hopefully they stack. I'm pretty sure they stack. Yeah. If not, I'll just wait until I'll just wait until this treated one becomes a regular one and then use it, you know. Okay. Yeah, because I've got, uh, it doesn't say how much longer. Aha, I am making an iron sledgehammer level three. I'm going ahead and scrapping the sledgehammers that I currently have. Or uh, just no, throw it into the forge. Don't scrap it. Throw it into the that's forge. True. That's true. I could do that. Get a wee bit more. Let's see. Scrapping it gave me 220 for the first one that I already did. Let's see how much I effectively get from forging it. It'll probably take a while to melt. And they have to do the math on whatever the difference is when you see it pop up. Okay, so my food and water is back to high levels, but um, I'm still got. So right now we have nine iron in the in the thing already smelted. So whatever it becomes after this sledgehammer is done, uh, this is what you'll get. Is what, yeah. You 
You still have your rifle? There's some ammo in here for it. Yeah, I've got the uh, machine gun. Of course, we can start tearing down like this crane. There's a lot of metal there. So the fortitude tree is the one with the machine guns in it. I don't know if you want to use the machine gun instead of me or what, because you're doing the fortitude um, mostly. Yeah, I do. I would like the machine gun, but I've been more worried about getting. Oh, I do have cardio. Okay, and healing factor, but I don't have iron gut. Oh, gatherer. Harvest three times from from the wild or from plenty crops. That's actually pretty cool. I'm gonna bind a grunt. All right, and I'll give you the machine gun. Okay. There's the machine gun and the ammo for it. All right. Thank you. Um, I'll probably start using shotguns because that's what the strength line goes to. Um, okay. And getting points into the strength attribute helps. Uh, uh, dismem head it says uh, and raises the headshot bonus and dismemberment chance with shotguns. So. Oh, that'd be pretty. Yeah, with shotguns, clubs, and sledgehammers, so. Yeah, there is food in here. He was right. Yes. I thought those machines only had, uh, only had drinks. Well, at least we can get some food from here. Yeah, dukes are, um, where are the dukes? We got, like, where are they? You have them? Uh, they should be in one of the chests. Oh, 378. Yeah. Here, give me half of them. Because I am low on food right now. <laughs> yeah, we're making a base where there's a, uh, <laughs> a food machine right here. So <laughs> if we find Dukes, that'll help. At least until it runs out. I don't know how many it has, but... I think it restocks, but it is, it's more vulnerable for the zombies destroying it. Yeah. But when they do attack it, they get electrocuted. Which is really hilarious when that happens. Actually, if you swing at it, you might get electrocuted. Don't, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. No, I was hitting um, some crap on the floor. Alright, so I've got... Rations, tuna, food cat food. Good. Usually the plain rations probably give you the best food. It's large I beef think. rations. It gives you 15 stamina, so yeah. I just went ahead and ate everything. There's still a can of um, pears in there uh, that I didn't have enough coins left to buy. And then there's beer, coffee, grain, alcohol, etc. Okay, there's no mods for the machine gun. Yay. All right, so I, I took the honey at 1.3, so I should be cleared in a bit. Yeah, it should be good now. Okay, so it went up to 300. It was like right at 300. So yeah, you can you get a lot more uh, iron value out of putting the sledgehammer in there.
Tomorrow, give me some iron. Yes. Hey, your help so, is all the way back up. Yep, I'll be able to make some shovels. I'll be able to make some pickaxes. I'll be able to make a lot of good stuff. Too bad that if you let's say you find a pickaxe, it's like level one, and you level up in your in your tool crafting ability, and then when you repair the old the old tool, it upgrades that, your ability. See, that would be nice, but it doesn't. But the alternative is we can smelt the, the old pickaxes and get the, all the iron back. Even if there's no durability, you'll get all the True. iron back. You lose the wood, though, but who cares? Yeah. Okay, we have any bone? Oh yeah, we got plenty of bone. Okay. And any poopy water. Yep, we got poopy water. I can make glue. Oh, can you make me a better bone shiv or knife or whatever? Uh, yes, I can make a hunting knife with the right uh, materials. Oops. I just smacked an unsearched mound of garbage by mistake. Oops. And it was, well, I mean, it was right here in the junkyard, so I thought it was searched, but apparently not. Because I'm trying to clear out the uh, trash and stuff off the ground in the junkyard here. And then once I get me an iron pick, I'm going to start taking apart uh, some of the other stuff. I got steel, not iron. I messed up. Okay. When you want steel, you get iron. When you want iron, you get steel. <laughs> Yeah. Let's see, for the iron pickaxe, I just need duct tape. I need more duct tape. I just made some. It's upstairs. Nice. I only made two, though. Yeah, I need four altogether. There's more glue cooking and some cloth. Yeah, I've got plenty of cloth of my, on my own. I've been taking apart things that have cloth in it. I get a lot of iron from this uh, workbench. Oh, another level yeah. six lead. I'm wondering if all the car nice. batteries are level six. Because you got two of them in this thing. Yeah. I got a level one wrench, so I don't know. I'm gonna go to that other uh, that POI that had another workbench and take it apart and get some more iron over by the corn farm here. Yeah. Because I got ten iron ingots from that. Let's try to get ten more. Oh yeah, you get lots. Wondering if I should 
Yeah, the pickaxe will be better. What am I missing? I need five more forged yeah, iron to make the pickaxe. That's awesome. I got ten from that one, too. Now I got twenty. Of iron, so I can make more uh, repair kits if I have some more duct tape. Nice. Which I need it now, because this wrench is all beat up now. I wonder what it costs to repair that other hunting knife we have. Uh, everything takes repair kits. So that's all it takes is repair kits? Yeah, just about everything repair takes repair kits to repair, with the exception of like the starter tools. It just takes uh, either wood or... Well, I'm making a repair kit after I make this uh, this pickaxe, and then I'm going to repair the knife for you. Okay. I'm making six repair kits right now. I'm going to make three. And I can repair my AK, I can repair my wrench. The ones I made before, I already repaired my, uh, my junk turret. Yeah. It takes 10 seconds to make a repair kit. And it looks like a toolbox. Yeah, it was just duct tape and yeah. a piece of metal. That's some amazing, amazing crafting there. Oh, yeah. I really want to find some mods, though. For the AK. Okay, I got some metal on me. I'm going to stick it into this forge. And I, I, I put my iron in, into the into the stack of forged iron already there. We could also smelt the steel ingots and then turn that back into iron. It's funny, the smelter actually has sand instead of glass listed now. Mm-hmm. But it still makes sand. Or, I mean, it still makes glass. Yeah. Oh, you broke down the toilets in here over at the bar. Wow, I'm getting stone from a sink? Yeah, the sinks are not metal, they're uh, stone. I'm getting metal too. I'm getting scrap uh, metal, pipe, and stone. And interesting. Porcelain, steel, I guess. Porcelain, stone. Or ceramic. Yeah, I'm gonna let you take apart all the metal stuff with the wrench, and uh, I'll take apart the uh, stone stuff. And you can go ahead and do the wood stuff, too. Well, yeah, it's, uh, the wood stuff, I'm just using my axe to take apart. Take apart a microwave. What do I get from a microwave? Electrical parts, plastic, and a little bit of iron. Same thing from a toaster. Same thing from a coffee maker. 
Yeah, the raw metal parts. I'll just uh Ooh, I need more cobblestone blocks here. Uh the raw metal parts, like just the piles of iron, I'll go ahead and do because it doesn't uh Yeah. Okay. And like I said, I'll just repair the uh thing as we go. Uh let's see, let me Now the barbecue to barely gives you anything. Now the Ooh, uh, zombies. The trash in these dumpsters shovel would be the best thing, right? Uh no. No. Probably the pig. I don't remember. Yeah, because it gives, it gives I, me... Well, the, the trash, I, the, the bags of trash that you loot, I just I'm, use axes. I'm, I'm talking about the piles that they're on, the dirt resources. Yeah, I think... I guess it depends what it is. If it's dirt, these use... It sounds like rock, so I'm going to just use the pick. It goes a lot quicker. During the early, when Alpha 18 first came out, the textures were weird on dirt and stuff, but they fixed it. Which is funny. Oh, this wasn't even looted yet. Awesome. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff up here that aren't looted. Ooh, a level 3 poker. And a stun baton. <gasps> stun And a working stiff crate and open up and see what I can get. Paintbrush, a battery, and a steel door. Wah, wah, wah. Iron door, whatever. Where are you at? Across the street. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Hi. Yep, on top of the bar. We never looted the bar. We never got to the roof and looted the, uh, the cool things. I'm looting all the trash in the uh, dumpsters here. Oh yeah, we haven't done that. I want to get this big red barn now. That's southeast from us. More corn. <laughs> there was a cooking pot just sitting here. Yep. There is always one cooking pot sitting on top of the trash. Ooh, more building some materials. Okay. How did that miss? So right now, Apart from, there's a washing machine up here that you can take apart. Yeah, I can, I get that. But all these bins over the, what is it? Six bins that are next to each other. I've gone ahead mm -hmm. and looted. I'm going to do the other two right now. I found more piles of done. cobble and, and cement. In the red barn that's southeast from us. Okay. Yeah, southeast. Alright, so now... More honey. Nice. Okay, that must be you I hear over there. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. I'm killing pigs and zombies. 
Ooh, yay, nice for meat. Wow, I smacked him once and only got six meat. I'll use my uh, spear for it, though. I don't have my knife. What's in this crate thing? It's huge. Oh, a whole bunch of hay. Hay? Hey, I got some cotton seeds. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. What's up? I fell in the hay bale and I actually sunk in. <laughs> there was a false bottom with a with like a, a backpack that I can loot. I looted it. There was nothing oh, really okay. in it, but I fell. It kind of scared me because I fell in and then sunk in like quicksand. It was weird. And the zombies are trying to follow me. Okay, zombies, if you gotta do it that way, then. Um, did we actually get zombies to fall into the pit down here? Yes, one. But she turned around to try to just smack the wall down. So I dropped down behind her. No, I opened the door and shut her and... Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm just... I was just repairing some of the... Spikes. Okay. All right, water. Nice. All right, I've got two hunting knives now, so if you want one. Yep. I'm by the forge. Oh no. Run, forest. I've got yucca seeds, I've got cotton seeds. I'm putting all the seeds at the bottom of the food chest. Yeah. Kind of take everything that I think will, uh, will uh, smelt and smelting it. Let's if see, I don't I think it'll be got... useful. I have an iron spear. It's level one that I don't need. You can smelt that, I think. Okay. Or keep it if you want to use it. Nah, I'll smelt it. Yep, 
You could smelt this um, iron pickaxe. Because I already have a, a level one. Unless you want another level one. I've got a level three iron pickaxe right here. Because I made it. Oh man, I want a, I want a level three iron pickaxe and a. Well, when we get a, enough forged iron, I can do it. But I'm also working on trying to get a uh, iron shovel and an iron fire axe. Well, we already have an iron fire yeah. axe, but I want a level three one. Yeah, well, we can just smelt these and, and make and get all the metal we need. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Uh, I'm I'm looking here. No, I can't you? I want to keep the steel, so we don't want to do that. We can smelt the batteries, but that gives us lead. If you have any scrap iron armor laying around that you find, you, that should give you metal. Uh, How about an iron yeah. door that we could... I'm, I'm still upstairs. There's an iron door that we can probably throw in the furnace. Um, don't, we've also got some iron tables down there that you can take apart with a wrench, probably. Yeah, those oh. you just have to use the pickaxe. Right? Oh, okay, I'll just use the pickaxe on them then. Here. Thank you. Yeah, anything that I think will be useful, I'm just leaving here. Uh, this, I'm putting everything that's this that level is one worth battery. Smelting. This level one battery, we should be able to go ahead and smelt, should we not? Yeah, but it just gives you uh, it gives you lead. Yeah, which is fine. We've got a tier a level one pistol that's almost out that I'm gonna smelt. Okay, I made the chest downstairs with all the iron bits that we can just get rid of. Okay. And I unlocked it. Um, what about the dumpster? That can, that, you can wrench that too. Wrench it or pick it? Yeah, wrench it I think gives you, will give you some mechanical parts. Alright, go ahead and wrench it then. And then there's the gas pump over here as well. Well, we got a lot of a lot of rotten meat, which is good because we can start a farm with. Oh yeah. green dumpsters get where it is well like the the one that's inside here yeah you know the problem uh, i just realized whenever there's a horde if we're going to be here on the roof they will tear up this whole pit well that's why i was going to have a i uh, a ditch around the building as well as around the outside. Yeah, so but that won't last long. They'll eventually get in. Well, I mean, they'll have to dig through the bottom concrete level because it's going to be a two-level down ditch. Oh, okay. Yeah.
Yeah, it's just stone and, and rocks. Stone and sand. In these large dumps. Yeah. I put my farms in I put my farm in one of these. Yeah, it's day six now, so I want to go ahead and get that ditch dug. Um, All right. I'm going to need more duct tape to get a shovel. What do you use to make glue? Bones. Bones and poopy water. All right, do we have any? We got bones. Yep. Yep. I don't see any. Oh, <laughs> you were making some up, but the uh, thing ran out of wood. Uh oh. Okay, dig in this trench, I'll help us get tons of clay. Almost night. Yeah. And yeah, that's the whole point of one of the whole points of digging the trench is to make a lot of, uh, to get a lot of, uh, clay. Iron shovel on its way. Okay, I'm still using one I have at level two. Once I get enough forged iron, uh, I'll make you a pick, an iron pick, a level three iron pick. Cool. I started the trench at the front, outside. Just outside the fence. Okay, I had started one outside the fence around the side. So, all right, it's nighttime. Okay. 